In the depths of the expansive Pacific Ocean, a curious marine biologist embarks on an epic adventure of whales. Delving into the mysteries of their minds, what they uncover is a stunning discovery. These whales might possess intelligence that surpasses even the renowned killer whales. Observing closely, something incredible happens. These whales imitate the calls of their feared enemies, the killer whales. This behavior extends beyond mere imitation. It suggests strategic intelligence, a clever ploy to evade threats or outwit other oceanic titans. This is none other than the pilot whale, a brainy beast that could only dare to outsmart the legendary killer whale. The journey of pilot whales into the annals of scientific discovery traces back to an old Japanese text on whales from 1760. Fast forward to the year 1809, and voila, they got their official name, Delphinus Mellis. With their sleek body design and long fins, these whales captivated the world of science. The pilot whales have a perfect blend of old Greek and modern science in their name, Globus kephale. Globus means round, and kephale means head, giving a perfect combination to call out their distinctive round foreheads. The name pilot whale comes from an old sailor's tale. It is believed that people used to think that each group of these whales had a leader, like a pilot, navigating the seas. Hence the name pilot whales. When you encounter pilot whales, distinguishing adult males is straightforward. They exhibit pronounced round heads and robust arched dorsal fins, setting them apart from both females and younger whales. There are two distinct varieties, long-finned and short-finned, each with its own unique allure and features. Preferring warmer waters of tropical and temperate zones, short-finned pilot whales are somewhat smaller compared to their long-finned relatives. Their flippers are relatively shorter, about one-sixth of their body length, and they possess a distinctive dental structure with seven to nine teeth per row. This dental arrangement and the shape of their jaws lend a distinct appearance to their faces. In contrast, long-finned pilot whales thrive in cooler waters. Their flippers are noticeably longer, approximately one-fifth of their body length, helping them gracefully navigate in the ocean. Generally, these whales are larger than their short-finned counterparts, particularly the females. Pilot whales are recognized for their beak-like snouts and elegant swimming, their slender, sharp flippers cutting through water effortlessly. Both long-finned and short-finned species are considerably large, measuring between 13 to 20 feet in length. Males are significantly larger than females, a testament to nature's grandeur. The long-finned pilot whales are especially striking with their dark, almost black skin and elongated flippers, well suited for their aquatic habitat. The largest males can reach up to nearly 22 feet and weigh around two tons, their prominent foreheads symbolizing maturity and vigor. These social aquatic marvels cherish camaraderie in vast family groups known as pods. Envision witnessing clusters of 10, 30, or even hundreds of these whales, a testament to their sociable nature, far surpassing our own social interactions in complexity and depth. These whales are not just sociable, they are formidable predators of the deep, with a penchant for squid, fish, and octopus. Far from being merely leisurely swimmers, pilot whales are adept at deep sea diving, venturing into the murky depths in pursuit of their prey. A standout trait of pilot whales is their sophisticated communication system. They utilize echolocation clicks, akin to a highly advanced underwater radar, surpassing any human-made technology. However, their communication isn't limited to hunting. They also engage in social interactions through whistles and pulsing sounds, maintaining a close-knit and joyful pod. These sounds, for them, are like visualizing sound waves, with each click and whistle representing words or sentences in their intricate underwater dialogues. Pilot whales, often likened to vivacious sea performers, are renowned for their spirited displays, exhibiting behaviors such as spy hopping, where they peek above the waterline, and lobtailing, characterized by tail slapping. These cetaceans transform the ocean into a stage of euphoria. They are not merely inhabiting the sea, they revel in its expanse, creating a spectacle of delight. The dynamics between pilot whales and their larger counterparts, sperm whales, present a fascinating aspect of marine interaction. Despite their formidable size, sperm whales exhibit signs of apprehension in the presence of pilot whales. This relationship mirrors complex social interactions akin to those observed in humans. 
The pilot whales, often perceived as domineering, display behaviors that are less about intimidation and more about a playful assertion in the ocean's vastness. Moreover, these interactions underline the diverse social structures within marine life. For instance, killer whales and pilot whales, despite their size disparity, induce stress in larger species like sperm whales, underscoring the intricate hierarchies and relationships in marine ecosystems. A poignant example of the unpredictable nature of such interactions occurred in 1992, when a woman, Miss Costello, experienced a startling encounter with a pilot whale. Misinterpreting human interaction as play, the whale pulled her to an astonishing 30 feet below the surface. This incident not only underscores the unpredictable nature of the ocean, but also highlights the complexities and potential risks when human and marine worlds collide. In the vast marine realm, around a million long-finned pilot whales traverse the seas, joined by over 200,000 short-finned relatives. These numbers, from the American Cetacean Society, depict a thriving species, yet they're not immune to danger. Fisheries pose a major threat, as these whales are driven and often injured in human-led hunts. Equally concerning is bycatch, the unintended capture of whales in fishing nets, underscoring the grim side of fishing techniques. Particularly in the Faroe Islands of Denmark, the long-finned pilot whales face a distinctive challenge. There, the traditional Grindedrap hunt results in the herding and capturing of these whales, with approximately 850 caught annually. Moreover, a baffling phenomenon endangers these whales, mass strandings. Instances like the recent stranding of 50 pilot whales on a remote Australian beach remain unexplained. Scientists ponder various causes, navigational errors, predator evasion, or disturbances from human-generated underwater noise. Understanding these challenges is crucial to protect these intriguing marine giants and their oceanic habitat. Our journey into the realm of pilot whales reveals a profound interdependence between our actions and their survival. This exploration serves as a vivid reminder of the significant impact we exert on these magnificent sea dwellers, who also call our planet home. We must embrace the responsibility to cherish and protect these splendid marine beings, striving towards a harmonious and sustainable coexistence with the animal kingdom.